Now, whether Kevin Rudd is arrogant or not, he clearly does have his fans. We know the polls are pretty good for the opposition leader, but John, today the new Queensland Premier, Anna Bly, was on one of those morning FM radio stations where they spin the wheel of embarrassing questions. And uh, her question was, who would you rather kiss, Kevin Rudd or John Howard? And uh, the new Queensland Premier said by far, Kevin Rudd with a lot of tongue. There you go. Oh. Oh dear. Okay. I don't think I want to know that. No, I didn't want to know that. I got a bit oh. of a shock. But... There you go. Okay, uh, mm. moving right along. Uh... And in the West today, there will be some Sky showers. News First Edition with Terry Willisy and Selena Edmonds. Well, as John Howard refuses to take blame for his government's poor performance in the polls, Peter Costello has stepped up his role in the election campaign, accusing Kevin Rudd of arrogance. The Prime Ministerial aspirations of both the Treasurer and the Opposition Leader hinge on the election outcome, now that John Howard has confirmed he will step down during the next term if he wins. With confirmation he will take over as Prime Minister if the government is re-elected, Peter Costello is happy to share the campaign heavy lifting. Oh, God. And that means digging away at Kevin Rudd's popularity. You're now seeing a great deal of triumphalism from uh, Kevin Rudd. He thinks he's got it in the bag. You see a growing arrogance about uh, Mr Rudd and the Labor Party. Arrogant or not, Kevin Rudd certainly has his fans. New Queensland Premier Anna Bly admitting on morning radio she'd rather kiss the opposition leader than the Prime Minister. Kevin Rudd, hands down, absolutely no questions. Oh. I reckon he's a hottie. Oh. Oh. I can't you... believe it. A little bit of tongue? A lot. A lot? <laughs> Kevin Rudd is also proving popular in New South Wales, with reports private Labor polling shows the party could win up to 10 seats in the state. When secret party political polling gets uh, released to newspapers, it's generally not very reliable. This election will be very tight because Mr Howard and Mr Costello will be launching a negative attack campaign on Labor based on... Uh, interest rates, based on unions, based on experience, it'll be the mother of all negative smear campaigns. It's been a rough week for the Liberal Party. John Howard has managed to hold on to the leadership, but he is now actively trying to steer the campaign away from a one-on-one -on -one contest between himself and Kevin Rudd. A vote for, for me is a vote for the coalition. But people don't vote individually for me. This is not a presidential race. They vote for a team. All eyes are now on Tuesday's news poll. If there's any good news for the government, John Howard's expected to head to the polls. David Spears, Sky News, Canberra.